We present Reality Talk, real-time speech-driven augmented presentation for AR live storytelling. Hi, my name is Adnan Karim, and I am a graduate student at the University of Calgary. Today, I want to talk about real-time augmented presentations. As you can see, when I talk about something, we can augment presentation using an augmented reality interface. We have several features, such as kinetic topography, embedded visuals, embedded icons, and embedded annotation to a physical object. All components are interactive with gestural interactions. And most importantly, all animations happen in real time. This means that no video editing or programming is required and thus it can significantly reduce the time and efforts of making such an augmented presentation, but also expand the tremendous potential for real-time live presentations like business meetings and classroom lectures. We introduced the concept of augmented presentation by dividing the workflow into two phases, the preparation phase and the presentation phase. During the preparation phase, the system provides an authoring user interface to allow the users to register the keywords and associated visuals using a keyword matching approach. Then the user defined visuals can appear on the screen based on the spoken keywords during the presentation. And during the presentation phase, the system incorporates speech recognition using web speech API, keyword extraction using Spacey, gesture recognition using MediaPipe, as well as visual embedding, object tracking, and world tracking. Here, we demonstrate augmented presentations by using Reality Talk. Hi, my name is Jane Doe, and today I'm going to present a sales report for the last year. We have two main products, the first being the Canon camera, and the second being the Sony. As you can see in this chart, both of these had similar sales increases over the last year, starting from around 10,000 units to over 50,000 units. This upcoming year, we will partner up with Best Buy to increase our new sales channel. Today, we're going to discuss white blood cells and killer T cells. In particular, we'll talk about the HIV virus and how it attacks the blood cells and hides from the T cells. We can see this displayed through this diagram of the immune system. Now we're going to show a quick video demonstrating this process. I'd like to introduce this new water bottle. It has so many benefits, including double wall vacuum insulation, this flexible perforated handle for easy use, and it's dishwasher safe. You can bring it with you to so many different activities, including going to the gym, you can bring it to the outdoors, and if you'd like, you can even bring it to the pool. And right now, we have a special discount, so grab your phone, scan this QR code, and get your own at 50% off. To design the system, we have collected and analyzed 177 existing video edit augmented presentations. And then within our analysis, we have identified the interaction design space that are inspired by the collected videos. Here, you can see the selected keyframes of multiple videos and the dimensions, namely textual, visual, location, and interaction. We also conducted a user study with 15 participants, and we evaluate our system from a presenter's perspective to demonstrate the features and effectiveness of our system. All participants were instructed to perform a two to three minute augmented presentation based on their own topics using our system. Here we summarize the user study results. As you can see, feedbacks from the participants were overall positive. They were enthusiastic about the system and helped us frame the limitations and future improvements of the system. Thank you for watching. This was a demonstration of Reality Talk.